Hey guys, this is here and welcome to today's Apple Studio Beginner Tutorial Part 3 Adding Piano Melody uh, First of all, uh, as you remember from uh, Part 2 uh, Yeah, uh, we've, did, we've done the adding bass line etc And uh, today uh, I'm just going to show you how to add Piano Melody So what you want to do now is uh, get rid of all the kicks if you want to make a note of it, what you did, you can. I don't really mind. So yeah, goodbye kicks, beats, etc. Uh, but leave the boo bass, what the first one. Get rid of the second one. All right, what you want to do now is um, click on pattern seven, F two, or right click rename, and call it piano. Uh, what you'd want to do next is uh, go on to channels, add one, and FL keys. Here you go. Uh, you can tr try out the keys by clicking on your keyboard. If it doesn't work, you have to go here and make sure that this is uh, highlighted, or you can always click uh, Control T as it says on the left. Uh, you can change it on this arrow here or here. this one so uh, just close it for now open up your step sequencer uh, right click and click uh, before you do that make sure that you add a uh, well one beat already so you can listen while you're doing it uh, what's going on so yeah back to step sequencer right click piano roll Okay, so first of all, um, uh, it's all right. Just click on song and press play. Yeah, that's alright. And the second one. down again yeah let's try it out you don't necessarily have to follow exactly what I'm doing you could just make your own run up and if you do uh, mistake by any chance you can always correct it afterwards and I will show you how alright uh, we're gonna go back to playlist view playlist 
uh, add our things into it. It's all cake. Uh, um, I can't really remember what it was, but I think it was something here. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, blue base, and then, you know. Uh, I think it stopped here. Uh, had to and snare. Let's try it out, yes. <laughs> go on uh, click on piano and then go on to view piano roll and I can change it around while you listen to the entire song make sure you click on song so after you've done your song uh, if you want to save it uh, you can go on file export and then you can choose mp3 file, uh, WAV file, whatever. I'm gonna go with mp3 file. And then wherever you want to save it, I might want to save it on uh, uh, just uh, here. And call it whatever you want to. So, your first song. And then click save. Okay, uh, chillax. I'll save it um uh, test my document. And then you will uh, recognize that something will pop up here. Uh, it doesn't look as complicated as it looks. It's pretty simple to use. All you need to do is um you can change the looping mode, whatever you want to. Uh, I'm just gonna leave it how it is. Uh and you can change this. Yeah. So I'm gonna go with the uh, 320 but it doesn't mean that if you change it higher it makes your song super clear but it does do changes and then just click start and now it will be done now I don't know where to save the uh, uh, try it out <laughs> Thank you for watching guys, please like, add me, subscribe and comment for more tutorials. Bye bye!